Right. But in the, uh, I agree. I'm, uh, I'm really uh, very comfortable about maturity of those believers in Ukraine. And we as a believers in America. Amen. We, when we will pray for Ukraine, we have to, like uh, the King Josiah. Uh, there was a four revivals in Old Testament. One revival it was with King, uh, King Josiah when he sent, he said, uh, bring that money in temple and don't limit them. Mm-hmm. Let those people uh, just restore temple. And you see, when the people were, had a willing heart to give to the Lord everything, they found the word. Could you imagine? God's people, they found a book. So the question is, where was it? Where the, uh, that book was? It was hidden in the temple. And then when the word of God were read from the book, he tore his clothes. He humbles himself and he said, send, uh, I need to hear from the Lord. And it was prophetess. Uh, who, uh, she was in charge of uh, wardrobes in the temple. And she said, tell that person, tell that king who humbled himself that he, I will judge my people. I will torture them. I will judge. I will discipline them. He's not going to see that. But, but, he said, uh, 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 because he's humbled himself, mm-hmm. he will not see that discipline. And uh, the next things what uh, King Josiah started, the uh, idols were started to destroy, smashed. Uh, pulled out from the temple, the uh, Asherah pole, uh, the Baal, the priests were taken out and uh, destroyed. This is, uh, we're talking about God's people. We are idols in our lives. Only God can show it uh, uh, as a root of bitterness. And any other idols which we, our children, our cars, our uh, self, self self-ambitions, if those are, uh, we come and really are crying to the Lord on our knees for all nations, but we have to start cleaning in our temples. Our temples of the Holy Spirit has to start to be clean. Amen. And the Passover is another reminder. 